Go ahead. How old were you when you started the show? And like, how did it? One, how did it start? Like, for for me, um, it was interesting. This is how long. Take ago us it was. from the very beginning. So from the very beginning, I'm gonna take you back to MySpace. Yeah. Y'all okay. remember MySpace? Yeah, yeah. So I got a message on MySpace one day. I never tried out for television a day in my life. I got a message on MySpace. Said that, hey, I'm a casting director. We like your look. We're doing a show. We would love. Um, Just randomly on MySpace. Randomly. You didn't and post like, anything. Nothing. 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 My my default hmm. picture was me like this in a tank top with like a tan and tattoos and muscles and Italian flag in the background, and that's what they used for my picture. But anyway, I didn't think it was real, so I never gave them my information until one day I came home from the club DJ and I'm like, you know what? Let me give them my number. And I gave them my number. They called the very next day. They're like, hey, so um, we want to film a day in your life, and I'm like, okay. I thought it was fake, so I gave them the info. They actually come to my house. And then I'm like, all right, so what do you want me to do? And like, just do what you normally do. So I took him to the gym. I had a tanning bed in my house. I took him tanning, and then I took him to the club. And were they filming this? They filmed it all. And they filmed me on my bike. They filmed a bunch of stuff. They just filmed basically a day in my life. They filmed it. And then they went on their way, right? I didn't hear from them for like six months. And then, that, that, and then I get a phone call. They're like, hey, can you pack for 30 days? And, and we're going to come to the Jersey Shore. And I'm like, for what? And I like filmed this show that didn't have a name. And I'm like, I didn't want to do it because I didn't want to lose my DJ gigs. Because I was DJing like six nights a week at these like local Rhode Island bars. And I didn't want to lose them. But anyway, I did. And I got these people to fill in for me. And then um, I went and filmed the show. It was like a, like a real world type show. It's like I met those people as perfect strangers. We lived in that house, filmed it. And then again, we went home. And I didn't hear anything or see anything till I saw. Um, I was doing my hair in the bathroom. So man. you guys filmed the whole first season of Jersey Shore. Yep. In 30 And days? we did it for free. You did it in thir- wow. 30 days? We though? did it for free. It took 30 days. Fuck. And just about. MTV fucked you? No, not really. So, did they tell um, you they were MTV though? They said it was supposed to be, it started off as VH1. Oh. But then it turned into the uh, because it was so good. They're like, oh, MTV wanted it. It was supposed to be. Like so it was show. just a random production company. They hadn't sold it to a network yet. At that they point, they did not. No, right. and it was VH1. That was do- they were doing it for VH1. It was okay. like some Guido and Guidette type of show. They had no name. Right. They didn't even have a name for the show. Wow. Fuck. Um. But anyway, again, they didn't tell us anything. So all of a sudden, I I'm doing my hair in the bathroom, and then I look at my TV. It's my, me doing my hair, and I heard my voice in the same bathroom. I was doing my hair. I was like. I was tripped out for a second. It was a commercial for the show. Yeah. And I hit everybody up. I'm like, yo, the commercial's out. The commercial's out. And then I was like, oh, it was just, I thought it was just going to be that cool to see yourself on television and that's that. But the show blew up because was, there was mad controversy because mm-hmm. the Italian Americans were yelling at yeah. us. A girl got punched in the face by a guy. Right. Didn't they really credit that punch in the face to why it blew up? Well, that's 100% part of it. Like, that's a huge part of it. Because, listen, that noise, um, it got people watching MTV that don't ordinarily watch MTV. So it premiered on MTV the first season. Yeah. Not VH1? Nope, MTV. And then, um, so then we, we ended up signing on for a second season, and they, they paid us. And they paid us for that. And then, um, again, I thought it was going to be two, two seasons, but it, it blew up and ended up being, like, the top show. And then... The stuff that we did as reality shows was insane. Like we were on Jay Leno, Ellen, like you guys stuff huge. reality you guys shows. It was the biggest do. show. I'm from Toronto, uh-huh. Mississauga, yeah. and it was huge. There. Were you? Were you yeah. like highest? everybody watched it? Me and all my friends so watched it. My parents watched it. Like, yeah, something just clicked, and then I'm like, that's 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 what's up. And so that's why the DJ and everything for us it was a, it was a win win. We kept it going. And we're still filming now to this day. Right. Eleven years later. 